Hello everyone, Huge Own One here. Welcome to the June 2021 Gamer Draft. Now we have some good news, we got some bad news. It all it's all coming up in this draft. I've previously tried to record this three times before, but I've been interrupted three times and I had this is the fourth attempt of me trying to do this. First time I, I the reason the first one didn't work out is because I had to take Luna out in the middle of it. Second time didn't work out because I had to fill the water dish. And then the third time, Mosley wanted to start barking, so therefore I had to take him out too. It was a disaster so, for this recording so far. So at least we got the fourth attempt now. All right, no more words. Let's get right into it. Here's how season six is going to work. There will be seven games that will be played next season. All of them will be played at least three times one stream and two normal videos on on those days now let's get right into the games so the first game is minecraft minecraft has been really nice since the start in season one it may have not been really popular because the only thing we really did in there it was regular survival videos or maybe sometimes creative i don't know we did adventure maps that really ticked me off, like Sky Adventure 2. That ticked me off the most. Oh my gosh. I'd stop doing that because it's that difficult. The first one wasn't really that hard, but the second one, I can't do it. I'm not doing it. Then, it wasn't really that popular and it had the slightest hate. Until Season 3, when we got introduced to Golden SMP. Now, at the first time I joined was actually in Season 2, but I didn't start recording it until Season 3, which was about a month after it opened. And ever since, we've been building structures all over the entire world. One day I should have a tour video based on every single city inside Golden SMP. Yeah, because uh, Stampy Longhead did it with his builds. You because should... there's a lot of them. There's a lot of cities and towns. We got Gold City, which is divided into four mini cities known as Ooland, something, something Farmlands, whatever some, that one was called. Nuked Village and Mount Gold. All part of the Golden City. There's just four different parts of it. And now we're starting a new civilization in Ultramore, which is... Which, no, we're not on the Ultramore Mountain. I decided to build this really... <laughs> tried to build this really big structure. That's going to take a long time to do. And, yeah, it's 100 by 100. But I had to drape in, like, remove some portions of the space for the building because, um, I think, who was it? Because one of the, um, players who, in the server, also decided to build structures in the area, so I had to work my ways around them. So, yeah. Next game! Next game, please! Thank you. Geometry Dash. This is the um, fourth season in a row that they have been around, and this time they're coming back for more. We've been doing a lot of streams and a lot of level requests towards the beginning of the year. There hasn't been that much this for the last two seasons. Hopefully we get more season three. As season three is the silver season last year, and July is the bronze season of last year. So we get to have some fun. Alrighty, moving on. Third game. There it is. Super Roblox Kart is coming back for a sixth season in the chapter. Now, at the beginning, SRK wasn't really um, a fan favorite as they have almost been voted out three times. But now they're not. Now it's not as hated as much, and it is actually 
striving just like the rest of the games are. As SRK is evolving, and fun fact, there is a new game created by the developers uh, with, of SRK, but this game is only going to be open to friends because it's got um, Nintendo stuff in it, and I don't want, and he doesn't, and I understand why he doesn't want it, friend, other people in it, because if it gets too popular, it's going to get claimed and it's going to get taken down, and I don't want that to happen. But I probably will make a video on it so that the rest of you who can't play it can still see what it's like. As it will be an entertaining experience for everyone. And, S and yes, they're actually going to make more tracks for the game too, which is very cool. I was notified about this literally yesterday by, SR by the SRK owner, Son Gotan himself. So this should be a great experience. Alrighty. Fourth game, Roblox. Roblox has not been around since last year, like mid last year. So it's almost been a year since I played any Roblox game other than SRK. Now that's about to change, as now we are going to play several different Roblox games, all in this category. In Roblox, though, whenever it comes to the games we play on the days that are marked as Roblox, no, it is not going to be SRK. It's going to be anything but SRK. Because SRK has its own days, kind of like every other game has their own days of when I make those videos. So this is really the first time they've been here in the entire chapter. So I want to see what it's like. We get to pick several games. Viewers, vote on the games you want to play for me. You want to ah, vote on the games you want me to play first. Because the first day of the um, Roblox is coming up soon. Game number five. Game number five. Among Us. Among Us is one of the most hated games on the channel that is still around right now. It's been fighting several conflicts, but survived six, survived five seasons, and it's going on the sixth season. Now, Among Us was really, really hated. And it was on the verge to being eliminated until the new map came out, which is the airship. And the airship is the only map I really play now because it's big and it's harder to kill people there. But it's also harder to get around there because of the one section with the um, electricity. But it's all good. We get different things and we are going to have fun. Game number six. Lego Star Wars. Over the past couple months, we have been completing story mode. Yes, we are done story mode. Now we are on the bonus levels, which I can't wait to show you guys. As we haven't played any of the bonus levels yet, but we will win the next time we get um, Lego Star Wars. So, to, I still need to come up with a plan of what I'm going to do after that. I'm probably going to do free play, try to get everything done. Or either that or the bounty missions. I'll probably do the bounty missions first. Because they're, it's a little bit different. As the goal in that is to basically hunt someone down, pretty much. And you get a large selection of characters that I've never seen in story mode. <laughs> And, yeah, it's going to be a great time. Then probably after that, we'll do the free play challenges, like getting uh, the stud bar full and getting all the mini kits, getting the red bricks. Yeah, you get the point. And then we'll do all the challenge levels where the goal is to beat the timer to get 10 blue mini kits, which I don't know what they do. And, yeah. And also, we got to buy everything in the store as well as we have not bought much because I didn't really care about studs because all I really cared about right at the point when playing story mode was to beat the game. Now, the goal after that is going to be getting all the studs. Alright, in our final game that we are going to be playing this season that hasn't been around 
It's only been featured a couple times in this year, but it was never on the schedule until now. Call of Duty Mobile is coming back. The first person shooter that we have been playing since the start of Era 4 is coming back. So, as some of you were sad that the game was not on the schedule, well, you won't be sad anymore because it's back. So, these are the seven games... The, one, the seventh game that's not on this list right now is SRK because it flew up on the top of the screen. I don't know what's wrong with that transition. But Minecraft, G-Dash, SRK, Roblox, Among Us, LEGO Star Wars, and Call of Duty Mobile will all be featured this season. Now, for Call of Duty Mobile, I believe today is the last day of the um, series. So if you don't get your rewards now when it comes to the current series, you won't be able to get them. As I think series one is about to end. Well, the second series one is about to end. No, I think it was. It's either one or two. Whatever one it was. I think it was probably the series two. But yeah, this is how it works. Everybody's going to go down leagues because it's the end of the series, so. Alrighty, moving on to the next page. Eliminated games. Every game that's on PlayStation 4, literally. For two reasons. Number one, Fortnite and Stardew Valley were voted out. And number two, the PlayStation is taken up 90% of the time, so therefore I am officially removing it from my schedules alternate all together because if I can't use if someone hogs a PlayStation for five million years how am I gonna make videos you can't it's just not possible and number two I heard that the PlayStation was also not gonna be here this summer as it was probably going to Virginia yeah I'm taking it with me because yeah, yeah that's I'm two to. yeah that's two reasons why we're not doing PlayStation games anymore and that counts as a platform change, which means it is now Era 8 of the YouTube channel. It is no longer Era 7. That's gone now. That's lasted five seasons. It is now Era 8, which hopefully we're going to – hopefully we turn it around. I It's sad to announce this, but this is literally the only way we can actually have videos all the time. Because didn't you, if y'all saw last season, it was not really that good. From mainly because the PlayStation was occupied ninety percent of the time by Nightmare. Literally, I've never seen anyone play it more than me, which is, is serious because I'm a gamer and gamers play it for a long time. But then again, I really cut back on using it. So, so yeah, that too. I'm only on it for like an hour so yeah let's move on to the next topic here is the schedule for the next season if you see on the top it says double trouble season we'll get into that afterwards but it is also pride month next month so get your rainbow suits on as pride month is coming up once again i'll probably use the same gear i had from last year that I did in Roblox. I had, if you remember, the rainbow wings, the ra rainbow hat. Well, not hat. It was a face thing. Rainbow tie. It was like, it's the glowing kind of thing, if you know what I mean. If you've seen the channel for that long. So the blue look is not going to be around next season, so. So, yeah. Yeah. Literally, to, literally tomorrow is Roblox, so I want you guys to vote literally, not in the live comments, but just tell me a Discord, please, because I'm not going to be able to read the live chat afterwards. I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. But sometimes it just doesn't do it, so just vote in Discord. 
Um, Lego Star Wars on Wednesday, the following day. Then the first Roblox live stream. Actually, wait. There's only one live stream for each game. Starting next season, though, in season seven, there will be two live streams of each game, because normally we have we set aside twelve days for games to be live streamed, and if there are only six games, we can do each one twice, which is great news for fans of the games that make it to season seven. So yeah, this is the schedule. Now here are the holidays. The Mon Monday the 14th of June marks another anniversary of us having our adopted American flag. So that's what Flag Day pretty much is. And then on Saturday, on the day that says Juneteenth, that celebrates our freedom because of slavery. And that's gone now. And thank gosh slavery's gone now. And because of that, that will also be streamed on this channel on that day as well. And then the day after that is Father's Day. And there's no better way to celebrate it than thanking your own dad. And now if you're wondering what all these mystery boxes are, no, they're not tier streams anymore. They, those are any game that is not on the schedule. Literally. Because I need to put in more games sometimes just to, to do something. I will not reveal what game will happen until a week prior to it happening. So as you can see, some of the mystery most of the mystery boxes are live streams, but the one on Wednesday on the 30th is not. That will just be a regular video. So yeah, moving on. Now, here's an announcement. Thanks for 300 subscribers, everyone. I really, really took a long time to get there, and we're finally here. So as a reward, I will be uploading twice a day for this season only. So instead of having one upload, I have two. The, the second uploads will all be in the form of videos, so don't expect two streams to be on the same day. There would be so on a stream day would be one stream and a one video. On video days it would be two videos. So it's double trouble this season. This is why I said this is gonna be I don't know if I said it in this attempt, but this season's gonna be twice as good than last year. Season six. So expect to see so actually, scratch the fact of voting for one Roblox game. Vote for two. We're, we're uploading twice tomorrow. So it's going to be fun, fun, fun. I don't know why I said that, but it's going to be fun. Next topic. Here is the teams. The member of the teams that you guys voted for. For example, the red team. I changed the name to the Vultures. We have Tropical... Sean Dilworth fan 23 and I forgot some thint. Now, I don't remember who two of you are on this list, but I do remember one of you. So if you know, you guys know who you are. You guys voted in the forums, so I went by what your email said. So this is what it says. Alrighty, moving on to the blue team. They've been renamed to the Blue Lynx. There's three people on here. My D is hard. I am I censored it because I don't want to put the actual name of that. There's Blinks and whoever 2 Incher is. So there's three people on the blue team as well. And then for the new team that we have formed, because we have 300 subscribers, it's the green team. And they're known as the Green Bruins. We have three players on here, Cocaine, Owen, and Cocaine Bro. Now, some of the, most of the names on this team are weird. So there's about nine players on here. So let's see what happens. All right, moving on. Notice, 
if teams are not balanced, which they are right now, but they won't be in the future probably, if teams are not balanced, then players will be switching teams by two ways, either by randomizing all the teams again and putting everyone on random teams, or the team with the least players will pick someone from the team that has the most players to join their team. This will be decided with a vote, so do not fear. Another notice, teams will be disbanded when the player count drops too low. So if we get below a large amount of players, then we will disband one of the teams. So teams will be disbanded when the player count drops too low to support the team amount, causing everyone on the, the disbanded team to switch to a different team by either a draft or randomly changing all remaining teams. This will also be decided with a vote, so do not freak out. If there is one remaining team, all players from the disbanded team will join that team. So be sure to do check it out. Now here is the team count chart based on the remaining players. Now you guys are wondering what the final series is. We'll get a, we'll get to it later. But the final series would have two players, one team, three to five players, two teams, six to eight, three teams. 9 plus for this season only. This is subject to change every season depending on how many people sign up on the forums. Now, two of the people actually who did vote on the forums did not sign up for a team, but I put them on anyways because why not? All right, moving on. Challenges with two to three teams remaining. Yeah, you guys are not expecting this. All teams will attempt the challenge in each stream. The losing team will send one of their teammates home by voting them out. So this is kind of like Survivor this season. And it's going to be exciting. Because there's actually a reward for the winning player rather than the winning team. At the end of the season. You'll, we'll get to it later. All play... When challenges get to a point where one team will be remaining all players will attempt a challenge in each stream the winning player will gain immunity which means you cannot vote them out and if you try to it will not count then everyone on the team will vote someone out except for the immune player again you cannot vote out someone who's immune so you could vote out anybody else and then challenges with two players remaining when we get to the final two, both players will attempt a series of challenges in which each of the remaining streams. The winning player of the series will be the champion of June 2021. They will be able to pick one mobile game that I can play. If it's something that I have not paid for, that is, that is a pay game. I probably won't be able to get it yet at all this season, so pick something else other than that but they will be able to pick a game for me to play in season seven as again two games will be eliminated but one of them comes back and the and that game decide is decided on you guys and whoever wins this so good luck to all nine of y'all who actually ended up on teams And now for the Ultimate Access Football League, which is on my other channel. If you do not like Access Football, leave this video right now. Because this is the rest of the video is going to be talking about the Access Football game. But if you want to hear it, then stay stick around. But if you don't want to hear it, thank you for watching. And I hope to see you guys next time. But for the rest of you who are going to stay... Let's get right into it. Now, here's the preseason week, week one. All games will be streamed on Huge Sports Network, which is my other YouTube channel. You should totally subscribe to it, unless if you don't like sports. Then I would understand. But preseason week one, this is what the schedule looks like. If you're not familiar with the teams, um, here they are on the list. 
You got Kansas City Wranglers playing the Nebraska Thunder. The Buffalo football team playing the Minnesota Pride. I would call them the Buffalo Indians, but we're just going to call it the Buffalo football team to avoid any bad things happening. Green Bay Axemen versus the Boston Whalers. Louisiana Gators versus the um, D.C. Senators. Pittsburgh Ironhawks versus the Dallas Lawmen. The Seattle Bruins versus the New York Barons. Baltimore Braves versus the San Francisco Sharks. Cleveland Coyotes versus the Carolina Royals. No, Carolina Rebels. The Royals was a different team on this list. The Indianapolis Gladiators versus the Denver Mountaineers. The Orlando Rockets versus the Detroit Firebirds. The Tennessee Bloodhounds versus the Cincinnati Royals. The Los Angeles Tide versus the Philadelphia Express. The Miami Warriors versus the Atlanta Razorbacks, which I literally... No, wait, was it that game? No, it was a different game. Never mind. Um, the Arizona Heat versus the Houston Bombers. The Chicago Lakehawks versus the St. Louis Racers. And the um, Las Vegas Outlaws versus the um, Oklahoma City Cyclones. This is all the games that are on week one. If you're not sure what this league is, this is a football league that is simulated through my other YouTube channel. There's also another league called the Extreme Access Football League, which is hosted by Extreme Boys TV. So be sure to check that out too. As it's currently season three, we are and I just finished all my week ten games. As I am actually a, a um, helper of the season, as multiple people contribute to streaming all the games. Now, you can see all the games will be streamed on different days on this list for the UAFL, also known as the Ultimate Access Football League, if you saw the title earlier. So be sure to check it out. Moving on. Preseason Week 2. We got the Dallas Lawmen versus the Kansas City Wranglers. The New York Barons versus the Buffalo football team. San Francisco Sharks versus the Green Bay Axemen. The Carolina Rebels versus the Louisiana Gators. The, um, the Denver Mountaineers versus the Pittsburgh Ironhawks. Detroit Firebirds versus the Seattle Bruins. Cincinnati Royals versus the Baltimore Braves. The Philadelphia Express versus the Cleveland Coyotes. The um, Atlanta Razorbacks versus the Indianapolis Gladiators. Houston Bombers versus the Orlando Rockets. St. Louis Racers versus the Tennessee Bloodhounds. Oklahoma City Th Cyclones. I almost said Thunder because of, there's an NBA team known as the Oklahoma City Thunder. But the Oklahoma City Cyclones versus the Los Angeles Tide. The Nebraska Thunder, which is actually called the Nebraska Thunder, versus the Miami Warriors, the Minnesota Pride versus the Arizona Heat, the Boston Whalers versus the Chicago Lakehawks, and the D.C. Senators versus the Las Vegas Outlaws. So that is all of Week 2, and we're going to get right into Week 3. Preseason Week 3, um, we have the Kansas City Wranglers versus the Denver Mountaineers, the Buffalo football team versus the Detroit Firebirds. The Green Bay Axemen versus the Cincinnati Royals. The um, Louisiana Gators versus the um, Philadelphia Express. Pittsburgh Ironhawks versus the Atlanta Razorbacks. Seattle Bruins versus the Houston Bombers. Baltimore Braves versus the St. Louis Racers. The Cleveland Coyotes versus the Oklahoma City... Th oh my gosh, I almost said it again. Oklahoma City Cyclones. Why can't they call them the Tornadoes? Oklahoma City Tornadoes. This sounds better. The um, Indianapolis Gladiators versus the Nebraska Thunder. Um, Orlando Rockets versus the Minnesota Pride. 
Tennessee Bloodhounds versus the um, Boston Whalers. Los Angeles Tide versus the D.C. Senators. The uh, Miami Warriors versus the Dallas Lawmen. The Arizona Heat versus the New York Barons. Chicago Lakehawks versus the San Francisco Sharks. And the Las Vegas Outlaws versus the Carolina Rebels. And then moving on to week four, which is the final week will be of the preseason. We will not go over the regular season until the end of season six, as that's, as we would go over weeks one through four of that. But for here, we have the Atlanta Razorbacks versus the Kansas City Wranglers, Houston Bombers versus the Buffalo football team, St. Louis Racers versus the Green Bay Axemen, Oklahoma City Cyclones versus the Louisiana Gators. Nebraska Thunder versus the Pittsburgh Ironhawks. Minnesota Pride versus Seattle Bruins. Boston Whalers versus the Baltimore Braves. D.C. Senators versus the Cleveland Coyotes. The um, Dallas Lawmen versus the Indianapolis Gladiators. New York Barons versus the Orlando Rockets. San Francisco Sharks versus the Tennessee Bloodhounds. Carolina Rebels versus the Los Angeles Tide. Denver Mountaineers versus the Miami Warriors. Detroit Firebirds versus the Arizona Heat. Cincinnati Royals versus the Chicago Lakehawks. And finally, the last game of the preseason would be the Philadelphia Express versus the Las Vegas Outlaws. So, yeah, that's the complete preseason schedule of the season. So, if you are interested in watching those games, check out the um, Huge Sports Network, and you'll be able to watch your favorite teams compete, as this is going to happen probably once a year, if we can manage to hold on to the league. But I'll try my best to, to upload to both huge tv and the huge own one youtube channel as well especially this season as we have a double trouble season so we'll see what happens and on top of that we still got the x afl games that we got to do too so it's a lot of work but it'll all pay off when it's all done so yeah this is the end if you guys have really enjoyed and are can't wait for the next season click the subscribe button on both not just both all five of my youtube channels as all of them have a different theme to it this one has huge own one has a gaming theme to it the huge own one reacts i haven't uploaded to it for a while i should i probably should do it like maybe once a week maybe but the, my reaction channel, Huge Own One Reacts, is basically me reacting to anything. It's just watching me watching other people's stuff, pretty much. That's basically what that channel is for. My third channel, Huge Own One Music, it's where I get to upload. I uploaded more than two videos on it. It's just that not all of them are public yet because, well... Let's just say I'm making an album called Pizza of all of this by pretty much sampling songs from certain songs and trying to make a dance beat to it. Kind of like the um, 2000s kind of thing. As right now I have two songs done and I'm still planning on doing ten more before I release the album, so. And then my fourth channel, which is, you been through a lot of changes, but it is now known as Huge Sports Network, is gonna be where all the games for Access Football are streamed. But the reason why I didn't really call it the, um, the um, Extreme Access Football League, no, wait. Ultimate Access Football League as a channel name. I called it Huge Sports Network because I want to talk about anything sports, not just Access Football. So if you have a request on what to talk about, 
anything. I should probably just um, I should probably just live stream my reactions to certain games like the Ravens games that I watch every year, and have it there. So I could rewatch myself getting angry if Lamar Jackson for some reason can throw an interception. And then and then my fifth channel is my vlogging channel where I literally go around and film basic areas. I try not to film other people because I don't film other people without their permission because I am a good boy. I don't do stuff like other people do because it's basically illegal because you got to have consent before you film somebody. And upload it to YouTube. Like, seriously. So, yeah. That's all five of my channels. If you guys enjoyed, subscribe all to all of them. And I'll see you guys in Season 6. After the live stream that I'm doing today.